Hello my friends, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here back in the Great War Redux mod. So, last time we were poking around, seeing if the world would ever be set on fire, and we kind of did. But right now we're at War of the United States, and we aren't quite doing that great, because, well, the U.S., these divisions are kind of thick. Yeah, I tabbed over, and for some reason they're like 37 combat width, most of their divisions are, and that's why we couldn't really do very well last time. Which, of course, is quite unfortunate. And you can see, a lot of my guys aren't that strong. And before you worry, that's only because I made these divisions huge. I want them to be 40 combat width, so they're missing a lot of equipment. And that's really fine with me, just to combat the United States' thick divisions. So, um, hopefully we can hold out in most of these places. That'd be kind of actually very nice. Well, you guys can do that. You guys can come over there. It's fine. Um, but yeah, we're going to struggle a little bit here. Yeah, look how, how quickly they're beating up our divisions. Uh, I thought we had two divisions holding here. Yeah. So that isn't really quite ideal. But you know, it is what it is. Please hold out, guys. Please hold out if you can. You guys are heading over there. Yeah, it'd be best if we don't get split up here. These, they might take our area over here, which would not be very good. We did sink another convoy, which is nice. So we really need to make more guns now. I want to make some heavy tank divisions as well, which we should be making one. These are only 18 combat width because we need to get some motorized on here. Cavalry really wouldn't be very good, so I'm just going to leave it at 18 combat width for now. But we're going to just try to take as much territory as possible. Uh, I'm probably going to lose that division, whatever. Cool. And they're probably going to cut us off. I want to kill these guys off. Let's get some sort of victory over here. So, a couple comments. Uh, whenever, whenever I take out the U.S., oh, they forgot they still own Alaska. Annex Alaska, so the borders look actually kind of nice. That is the plan to do that. A very good plan, I might add. Yeah, and I did push over here because we do have eight divisions, which is quite a bit, but still, they're only like 20 combat width. So it is what it is. Uh, hold out, please. Hold out, hold out, hold out, hold out. Uh, don't worry about attacking. Ottawa. Be on the defensive for now. Interrogation techniques. Um, We're going to do passive defense. That seems like a good idea. And now we can do this. Henry Tarwalt. Cool. Come to D.C. The cesspool that is the District of Columbia. Let's do Chicago. And end of the convoy. Very nice. Ooh, the Germans are breaking the French lines. They like it. Uh, another comment was, keep up the series and maybe eventually go to war with the Central Powers, maybe? Sounds kind of like fun. Maybe we'll do that, actually. Nice. He's got some more infantry stuff. Uh, yeah. Maybe join the Central Powers. Maybe not. Maybe take out the Central Powers. That'd be kind of cool. Alright, so I don't want you to kill yourselves on the line. Ten. Uh, I'm not getting involved in that war. I'm already involved in the war against the United States. So, yeah. You're going to deal with that later on, man. Sorry. You might deal with that yourself. Maybe do that, do that, do that. So maybe we can circle these guys. That'd be kind of nice. Maybe encircle these guys up here, see what happens. Yeah, Russia, yeah. See what happens. Keep the series up. That's pretty much it. I uh, also said, like, a couple episodes ago, I wanted to do the one with the Prince Hohenzollern. I really wanted to, but the reason I didn't do this path, because when you go up here, it's just to give you give you more daily democracy and fascist support. You, I could have gotten more daily political power gain and eventually just gone this way, but it doesn't give you that much more fascist gain. And I want to turn fascist as fast as possible. Um... Yeah, with the Lord Protector of England, you get that very quickly, much more quickly at least, than anything else, so that's why I did it like that. Oh, we found some more convoys. The Belgian convoys go boom. Well, there's only one right there, but whatever. So hold out for as long as we can, guys. Keep it up. We've lost quite a few... No, I don't know guys we've lost. 9,000, 126,000. They've only lost 54,000 because our armies just really weren't ready for this conflict. I was not expecting to see this how thick some of these enemy divisions were going to be, so. But I can say we're doing fairly okay on the west coast, which is kind of nice. Anything over here? Um, war bonds. Oh, I love me some war bonds. Military high command, entrenchment speed. That might actually be worth doing right now. Let's do that, just so that whenever we move, we can entrench it a little bit faster. While trying to get way more guns and artillery pieces, so. I make mistakes. I definitely make mistakes. You guys come down here. Cut them off. Did you guys win here? You might be able to, actually. Hey! An encirclement. Nice. I love my ships. I hope you love my ships as well. They're very nice ships. Then, once we get a carrier out, I will rename it. Which means we need to do some carrier technologies, too. I hate only having so many, so few research slots. This is taking forever to kill these guys off. Oh, my goodness. Go and do that. Help them out. Help them out. Give us more XP. Even though we don't really need more naval XP. And we raised our conscription level. Cool. Form a stratocracy. Okay, well, that sounds nice. No country for red devils would be nice as well. 
We can't do this, but we can do Royal Armaments Factories for former military factories. We must prepare for the coming storm in every possible way. We finally have more than 75% war support, which is very nice. Alright, so you're not winning. Which is fine. Hold for now. Alright, well, America, you guys can keep attacking me. It ain't going to go very well for you in the end, probably. Hopefully, we've been cut off here, but whatever. Don't get Bangor, probably. That's what, is that how you pronounce it? Probably Bangor, I don't know. Montreal is falling, which is not good. Oh, we finally did it, thank God. Woo, we finally went over here. Nice job, guys. Now you're suffering from a lot of attrition and, and stuff like that while these guys are moving in through here, which isn't very ideal, but whatever. Really, at this point, we just got to produce more. That's all we need, just more production of stuff. I'm making a military factory. I'm not making enough military factories. What the heck am I doing, man? What am I doing? You know what? I've been mean to Scotland before, and I will continue to be mean to Scotland. But let's build them up. And do that too. Very nice. Nice. Very good. Very good. At least we did a great job encircling a few divisions. Now, they weren't great. It wasn't great at all. Too much. But you know what? I'm going to take every victory I can possibly get. Oregon. It's Oregon territory. We, that belongs to the Imperial Federation. The Great Imperial Federation. Do we have any... Oh, he's learning Iron Sides and Fleet Protector. Very cool. Very cool. When you guys keep attacking me, it, it might be better if they had just attacked me in my core territory. That's kind of nicer, to be honest with you. How much support going? We don't have that much support going. Uh, you guys, since you guys are getting kind of thick, let's do that. You're getting a little too thick in different areas that I don't like you to get too thick in. Ah, oh, beautiful. France is struggling, which is fine. I really wish we could join the Central Powers, ally them, they could help us out, and then we could beat them up. Hey, Detroit. Do we really want Detroit, though? We might. Let's take Detroit, because we can. Oh, you have to go through there. Oh, that sucks. That really sucks. And we're getting attacked. We might win, we might not. So yeah, for now, it's just going to be kind of holding out, having a good time. Blowing up a couple uh, convoys here and there. The convoys are literally dying, but we don't see them in the peace deal, or the, you know, victory thing. A little disappointing, but whatever. Whatever. The Americans don't have a navy yet. They might eventually, though. Montreal, they can't really beat us up anymore too much on defense. Who the heck is attacking my son? Why you do that? It's Robert. I don't think I told you to do that. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. We're going to need some more divisions for over here, though. So it really kind of sucks. Let me have to, you guys. Put you under new command. Herbert Plummer. Plumer. Plummer. Cool. Do that. Hmm... We're over here, too. And now artillery needs barely going up. Infantry equipment is at 85,000 deficit. It's only 85,000. Construction 3 would help out. Get some more output if we can. Yes, please. Build, 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 build. Because we definitely need more artillery and guns. Oh, my goodness. So many artillery pieces. Oh, so many guns. And we can't break over to Detroit. Oh, oh yeah, we can. We got Detroit. Nice. It's not like we really wanted Detroit, but you know what? I'll take more factories. This is proper uh, British territory now, or really Imperial territory. More passive defense, a couple more convoys go boom, and everyone, or at least most people, are happy. Happy enough. Let's be real, happy enough. Oh, now they're, they're really attacking us. They can't quite win, though. Even if we lose Bangor again, we'll be over River, which is kind of nice. The more they attack, the more they spread out their lines, which is kind of a good thing for us. We, lo we win, we lose in some areas. I can't wait to get another tank, though. Oh, you guys come over there. Also, let's see. We probably need... We can stop acquiring so many of these divisions. There you go. There you go. That should help things out a little bit. And once we get our tanks, it will probably be not too bad for us. Man, you guys are really struggling. But we do have a cup of Kona coffee. Unfortunately, no tea here today. But a cup of Kona coffee to keep us nice and warm. Oh, look. Build, 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 my friends. Build, build, build. That's okay. You don't need to move. Just hang out. Defend the territory. Uh, I would recommend you keep Vancouver... I, I like Vancouver. Yeah, go that way, please. Thank you. I'm surprised they're not really attacking through here. Hey, we did the sack for the U.S. Cool. Mexico. Uh, France. Germany. Yes. Who cares about all y'all? We're going to do it anyways, eventually. Good. Good, good. Losses. Well, they're definitely catching up in losses, which is very nice. Very, very nice. Yeah, you guys... You guys like taking over my territory? That's okay. I like taking over your territory, too. I'm glad to make these guys a little bit thicker so that they really struggle now with trying to take territory. You know, they're still winning in some places. It is what it is, you know. 
But I'm glad we have almost all of Washington. Oh, we do have almost all of Washington. Ooh, they got Vancouver. Ah, more factories, thank God. Sheffield Steel. Sheffield Steel is widely regarded as the best on the planet. Oh, pretty good. Oh, that's disappointing. Um, give me half of you guys. Oops, never mind. I misclicked. Thank you. Come here. You. Come here. You. Come here. Leave and help out. Right here. Please move. Because I don't want to get these guys encircled or destroyed or anything like that. We need one, two, three more divisions. Oh, that sucks. Man, they're really pushing us out. What? Man, Canada. You really should have built more infrastructure up here. Oh, my goodness. The roads, my sons. The roads. It looks like they're... So they should have enough man... Do they not have enough manpower? Well, they're on... No, they have a third of a million. They must not have a lot of equipment. Um... America, you might... Mmm... What happened to your artillery, America? And guns? Uh, America. America, what are you doing? You're supposed to be big industrial power, right? Did you ship them away to, like, Puerto Rico or Hawaii or Philippines or something? America. America, please. Well, um... I'll gladly take that, yeah. I'll, uh, yeah, yeah, I'll gladly like that, yeah, sure. Um, I really need more divisions around here. I mean, they can expand as much as they want, but once they overstretch themselves, they'll be easy to encircle and destroy, hopefully. Hopefully. Uh, let's get some... Let's, I really can't afford a war over there, which is fine. Get an extra division. First London. Luxembourg is gone. Very cool. A. There we go, my friends. I've got a carrier, but no planes to put them on. Nope, that's not a useful victory. Usually. There you go. Design is not bad. Terrain, well, whatever. I'm going to throw you guys right here, even though it's not going to be helpful whatsoever. So we really need to start researching more plane stuff. We're doing better on guns, I think, at this point. We don't have nearly as much of a high deficit. Oh, and they're still trying to attack us like crazy. That's not cool. Oh, we have some research deficits as well, huh? Oh, we need steel? God dang. That really sucks. Cool, do that. And we get more manpower. Naval department, build more factories. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. Hey, you know the ship. Light cruiser, cool. I'd love to attack, but we can't really afford that right now. But we do have a cup of, cup of coffee, which we will enjoy. Cool. Tons of factories, tons and tons and tons. Fighters. Can I get any? Uh, no, not yet. Disappointing. Keep it at five, keep it at five. Oh, now they're attacking us. That is not good. That's the case. Pull out. Because I don't want you to circle and destroyed. Come on. Come on. Nice. We get some more soft attack. That's going to hurt them, hopefully. Uh, we need to grab motorized. We definitely need motorized here. I don't want... Oh, we might get encircled here. That's not good. Come on, move, 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 move. Good. Imperial Nigeria. Oh, that sucks. Go and retreat here, too, both of you. Because we might get encircled and destroyed. That's not good. How about support the defense? Support the defense. Cool. Yep. Oh, and there goes France Joseph. Oh, Italy has broken through France. Nice stuff. Good. You don't worry about that. If anything, begin retreating this way since we don't have a port. Nice. Good defense. Good strategic defensive maneuvers. Good. Hey, Raj. Sure, yeah. Oh, yeah, Raj, baby, yeah. Sorry, Germany. I'm kind of abandoning this area because the supply is really just what we call Garbo. Consolidating forces where we really need them. And you'll have a time regardless. We still have more casualties than them, but whatever. Yeah, please re hurry up, research. Infantry infiltration, more soft attack, and less supply consumption. That's going to be nice. That's going to be very nice. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Just actually move up this way if you can. Oh, don't move. Don't come down here. No, no, no. We're all leaving this position. What are you doing? You know what? The supply is so bad. Just do that. There you go. Let's 
So attack, come that way. Good. Nice. Very, very good. And now we're going to grab Shock Troops for more land night attack. Oh, God dang, they're very, very aggressive. Oh, and now we can do this. Land of in Inventors. We are Land of Inventions and Inventors. Good. We're running out of fuel. Are you guys up there yet? Come on. Good. Nice. Yeah. I don't think the carriers can really do too much, but that's okay with me. That is totally okay. If France falls, maybe we can join them in an alliance. Yeah, no, the guy, they're, they're really going to fall now. Yeah, I can't ask to join them. I've accepted too much world tension. Well, we'll see what happens. Are they attacking me anywhere else? Cool. We definitely help our line out a little bit more, so. Reform the front line. That'll be good. And I'm really just waiting for tanks. Edmund? Uh, recover faster. That'd be kind of nice. And we're out of fuel, which is not ideal. Mexico. I love Mexico. Oh, now we need less of this. Good. Yummy, yummy fuel. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Which probably isn't good. I keep putting ships on there to consume even more fuel, but it is what it is. Uh, the fall of Constantinople. The Turks explode from Europe. Nice. We don't have to do anything for them then. Take them out, Bulgaria, even though you're still fighting the Greeks. Oh, the Austro-Hungarian Serbia. That is... Ugh. That is disgusting. Oh, but Turkey, what are you doing, man? What are you doing? Really? Why did they join France? Now we're going to fight a bunch of Mexicans. I want Mexicans on my side. I love the Mexicans. What the heck? You know what? I'm not going to support you anymore then. I like Venezuela. Venezuelan bros, you know. Good old Venezuela. Cool. Not really much going on over here, which is fine with us. Deficit is getting slightly worse, actually. Which is very not bueno. Oh, uh, and there's a reason why. No, not really. Not really at all. Cool. Now we can finally use him. Uh, you guys all look garbo. Ivor. I'm going to send you two here. Because this will really prove to people whether or not tanks are really that good. Against Montreal. Uh, no, maybe yet. No, not yet. Okay, if you really want to lose, we can move all this way. The Entente surrenders. Having lost control of the front, France is no longer able to fight. The Great War is over. Okay then, so... Um, does that mean, like, this all pieces out? Do we get anything from the U.S.? If not, I mean, I will go back to war with them. Because the peace deal in this game, it's it's a little wonky, not gonna lie. We're doing okay, we're not doing great. Uh, so, I mean, yeah, we've lost 313,000. America's lost 185,000. If not, I'll just re-go to war with the U.S., so it, it's totally fine with me. You know, what happens, happens. Wow. Yes, friends, yes. I wonder what the peace deal is gonna look like. We'll have a Kaiserreich, maybe, German Confederation of some sort? Maybe? Maybe not? Oh, and there they go. Peace out. U.S. joined them. Do... Oh, no longer have that. We're, okay, so we stay at war. Alright, so, so I end up fighting just... So I end up at, still at war with... Oh, we lost a division. That sucks. Consolidate our holdings, that's fine. Get the guys over there. Um, yeah, no, I think France has to be at peace. No, I don't think this this makes sense. That's okay, though. Whatever. Finally, motorized infantry. Good, good, good. Next up, we shall grab... What was it that we needed? Well, we could use military police. We could use a lot of this stuff, actually. Artillery? Yeah, let's get some artillery. That'd be helpful. Well, we're doing slightly better on artillery right now. Tank-wise, we're doing okay. I will lower this to 10, though, so we can help support more of the war uh, goals. There we go, there we go. Hopefully, all we need is one tank to really do the job. And they're not over there yet, which is fine. They're still... Oh, they just got over here. Nice. How have you not been... You're, not, you're still fighting. Yeah, I don't really understand this, Germany. Would... 
Hmm. That really sucks. I continue to end up fighting the entire Entente for some reason. Whatever. Whatever. No problem. Uh, I could raise... Uh, I could raise this. Uh, yeah. Weekly stability. That's, that's okay. Smooth talker, quartermaster, civilian stuff. Hmm. We're going to address stability with other means. I think right now we're going to go with military dockyards. Military dockyards, military industries, because I can always, I could always use more and more and more. It sucks building stuff there, but do it anyways. Do it anyways. And Ireland. Oh, God, please don't tell me we're going to have Ireland. Irish independence movement. It's a lot of manpower, though. It's really nice. Alright, so I'm going to pull you guys out since, uh, yeah, that doesn't look very good. But, if we can truck on down to basically Washington, D.C. after attacking Montreal, that'd be really nice. It might be a little quick, but, you know, let's see what happens. Get you guys to attack. They should not be able to pierce our armor. Um, oh, this is commanded. Zero out of three can pierce our divisions. Good. You cannot pierce these heavy tanks, even though we can't even win here either. Oh, God, no. Ah, good. Land of inventors. Nice. Canceled on these. That's not good. Business as usual. Oh, that's really nice. Upon the outbreak of the First World War, it was stated by gover gover government minister that the economy of Britain would continue to do business as usual. That helps help us. Help us. Help us. Out. That will help us out. I cannot speak. Words are hard. Hope you're having a great day. Woo! How can we not win? I mean, they can't pierce us. Especially if they're attacking somewhere else. I mean, come on, man. Yep, they're definitely struggling against us. Um, I really don't like this peace deal. Even though, actually, the peace deal released... Oh, God, you released Hungry. What the heck, man? Oh, Horthy. Uh, do you have a focus stream? No, it doesn't look like it. Support Russia, support... No, it's kind of generic one. That's fine. That's fine, whatever. Oh, wow, Bulgaria's doing great against Greece. Holy cow. I want to see France, like, go kaboom. Why hasn't America capitulated? Or, like, done... Had any problems? Because the Entente, they were in the Entente. They're still in the Entente, and they still haven't done anything. Uh, this is getting stupid. This is getting really stupid. Uh, yeah... I'm going to have to break up the Entente. This is this is not quite fair. So, I will see you in just a little bit. All right, my friends. So, here we are. What we've done, or what I've done, is kind of let time go on. Um, just to see what happens with the Entente and faction. So, that we have a farm crisis, crisis, though. A sharp decline in the prices of farm production due to the restoration of European agriculture after the war provoked the impoverishment of villages in the country. The crisis was especially bad for countries with a large production. The... some sort of modifier. I can't read that. Which grants recruitable 5% population factor, 5% consumer goods factories, and minus 20% construction for two years, it looks like? Something bad is coming. Cool. So this is the world. And I was basically waiting until the U.S. got out of the faction, which took forever, but now there is the North American Entente. Um, Italy has joined Bulgaria, and they are smashing the heck out of Pantrania, which is insane to see. We also have Romania, which joined the White Movement, even though they're so cut off from the rest of these guys. You know, except for the Black Sea, of course. And I need to invade Belgium. In which Germany has now taken over uh, Luxembourg, Valoni, and Vlandern. Vlandern. They're allied with the U.S. So. And also, for some reason, uh, they started abandoning some of their positions, and I've just kind of been trucking through here a little bit in the Northeast. Uh, well, quite literally, I'm all the way to Providence. Which is kind of weird, but that's okay. That's okay. I'm totally okay with that. Uh, casualties, quick look, 222,000. And we are, well, three, a third of a million. So, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Germany, are you a... W um, are you a... I don't... Yeah, you're not at war with the U.S. I'm like, okay. That'd be a bit weird. Also, I've let time go on. I mean, we were doing slightly better on guns and artillery, so... It is what it is. Persia joined the White Movement, which is probably good for the White Movement. Uh, and we're just pretty much still holding the line. Nothing's really changed too much, to be frank with you. I mean, we have our tanks. And for some reason, the U.S., like I said, has abandoned parts of their line. But it's time to kill off Ottawa. Ah, oh, crud. Yeah, there's no point attacking there. Um, why are you... Why are you going? And also, we've been losing parts, portions of the line here, which really sucks, too. Retreat both of you that way. That's fine. Totally fine. As long as you don't get overran, that's what matters. Kill these. Oh, I don't know if I can kill these two divisions off. Move, move, move. 
tanks are good, but mm, they can only be so good in a struggle like this. Go ahead, help up, take them out. Good, good, good. Really just a game of waiting until we can destroy the Americans. That's pretty much it. That is pretty much it. Um, yeah, they've definitely expanded quite a bit. But our production is going up, at least. That's good. Let's see. Go up to five, go up to five. We need more artillery. We need more of pretty much everything. Uh, we're pretty much done building stuff down there. Uh, and we'll show you a little bit more as we go along here. Cool. Uh, please come up. I'm going to put them all up here just because I don't want these areas taken over too much. So, and I need more military factories and space to build stuff. we got some political power. We can do that. War bonds are always nice to get. Always, always, always nice to get. Cool. Aust the Austrian Empire is so sad. It's so sad. Church secularization. That's kind of nice for you guys, but still. Uh, yeah. Join wars. Justify wars. Can you create a faction? Probably not. Oh, what was that national spirit? Farm crisis. That's what it was called. It will be ended by next year sometime. Please, can you help kill them off, please? Please. Oh, they stopped attacking us. That's kind of good. 31 guns a day isn't really ideal. Hey, we took Boston, though. That's not bad. That really ain't too bad. Nice. Hop out of here if you can. Actually, hold first, and then do that. And then you guys are the same. Man, you guys are extremely weak. Need so many guns. So many. Help destroy two divisions in Ottawa. It's looking really straight up here, which... That's yeah, okay. They pretty much stopped attacking. Uh, Washington. Uh, infrastructure is so bad down here. Why is it so bad? It's not like you guys... I really don't understand why it's so bad. Bad supply. I mean, yeah, I mean, it's not great. No, we're done with our land doctrine, though. It's cool. But still, it shouldn't be that bad. Grab some better artillery so we can hurt them a little bit more. Very good. Uh, Belgian convoy. Hello, let's grab one more. Thank you. Italy requires colonies. Italy believes that under the treaty with their allies, they receive very few territories while suffering thousands of losses for pieces of land. They want from us even a small colony in the region of Ethiopia. Are we ready to give it to them? Uh, the Jubilan Sara Egyptian Serenica. Wait, Egyptian Serenica? What the heck? They they can have Serenica. Um, Sara? Because I'm not giving them Alexandria. Jubaland. Jubaland? Khartoum, Aswan, no. Uh, British Somaliland. I don't mind giving them that. Oh, they want Jubaland? Uh, you know what? Oh, we lose war support. What a cheek. I really don't want to fight those guys. Let's see what happens. Let's just see what happens. We lose some war support. Has anything really changed too much? Oh, there's that, yeah. Cool. I mean, yeah, we want to keep good relations with you guys. I mean, it's fine with me. I don't really care. I'll be honest. Hey, we, look at that. We did it. We took back Ottawa. We are on the upswing right now, it seems like, just a little bit. And I think it's time to cut through the Northeast a little bit more. So you guys can come right here. Very nice, very nice. Also, also between this, between me fading out and fading back in, um, they had a border war between Mexico and the U.S., which is actually kind of nice. It was nice, pretty nice to see. My god, we need so much more resources. Oh, we need some more of this. But, um, yeah, I think they might have lost a division or two to Mexico, maybe? Maybe? I mean, I forced them out of the faction, so they started fighting each other. But other than that, I don't know. Let's get some of that. Cool. Head on down here. Uh, if you could. You are incredibly weak. Holy cow. Bring the tanks along. For a little bit of a ride, and then push up this way. And then we'll push up that way. Actually, you guys could go that straight that way. That'd be amazing. I'm glad we, at least we could do a little bit of stuff with our navy. So, America is such a mess. Then again, you could say that at any time. Uh, maybe this time in history. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, actually, you know what? Just hold. You guys help support the attack. Uh, I really don't want you to help this attack. But, you know, whatever it is. It is what it is. Cool. Even though these guys are extremely weak, give them a little bit one two buckle my shoe. You know, some of that good stuff. We probably lost a few more divisions just because, or more manpower, because we don't have that many. We just lost 4,000. Wow. I'm not even sure where we're losing them, too. I mean, yeah, supply sucks down here. I don't understand. Wait, I don't understand this. Okay, so we're suffering attrition, right? How are they not suffering a single point of attrition? This is exact same state. 
something is not right here. Like, you can't tell me, though, that I have a lot of resistance. Yeah, it's 27%. But that shouldn't matter nearly as much. Especially if we're building up infrastructure. That seems a bit odd. That I get zero supply, basically. Almost zero supply there. That doesn't make any sense. That, that really doesn't make... Oh, my God. 40... Oh, it's a mountain. Okay, that, at least that makes sense. Cool. You guys kind of hang out for now. Just hang out. Have a good time. Maybe have a smoke or two. I could risk these guys and make it a beeline for New York. Legacy of the Boer War. Very nice. Even though we can't use our land auction anymore. Um, support equipment. Motorization. Yeah, let's get some camouflage. So, our red uniforms still got like sore thumbs during the Boer War. Whereas the Boers effectively hid themselves from our soldier sights. We would do well to apply a more discreet coloring to our uniforms. Yes, yes, yes. Hey, look at another ship. Nice. Oh, that's what I forgot. I keep forgetting. I need close air support planes. Or just carrier planes, I mean. Carrier planes. Nice. Come on, guys. You guys can do this. There's, they should be starving for supplies, but for some reason they're not. I don't know why. Uh, we could use more war support, too. Airfares. Airfares? Oh, yeah. Good. You guys go there. You guys just take New York and Newark. If we get to Philadelphia and D.C., that'd be awesome. That's been done. Good. Heave ho, gentlemen. Heave ho. Well, once we get there. And boom. You ain't leaving, son. You ain't leaving. Nice. Help them out. Help them out. They should not be able to pierce these tanks. Good. Good. And they are gone. Nice. Spread those lines out, even though they're pushing us back in some places. Yeah, this is really bad. This is incredibly bad. And let's make sure we got this going. Uh, another line. Sure. Cool. Guns. Hey, we're doing slightly better. And on artillery as well. Hold, hold, hold. We got New York. Make sure we keep it. Uh, we might be able to cut everyone off up there. It'd be kind of nice, actually. Give me one of you guys. Go that way. Cut them off. You guys go there, cut them off. You guys come here. Just take all the land. The more land we take now, the less supply or resources the enemies will have later on. And we could use their factories too. So infantry, infantry, good. Grab that. Cool. Take, 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 take. We didn't want Baltimore anyways, right? Let's see. Good. These guys are gonna die here. Awesome. Uh, just in case. Go back to London Flames. I don't know. This might be copyrighted. This might not be. I have no idea. Look how long it takes just to destroy a single division. It's ridiculous. Cool. Uh, you guys can probably come right there. Oh, no, you can't. That sucks. They, they know what I'm doing. They know exactly what I'm doing. Go, go, go. Hey, this is Northeast. is actually looking pretty good for us. Okay, not too bad. You might as well grab that piece of territory. I've kind of abandoned focus, my focus on the west. It just makes more sense to come this way. Do it like this. Good, good, good. Oh, you guys are losing right there. I uh, think. Bueno. I need field hospitals too, but we don't have enough support equipment anyways. Oh, like, barrage time. Nice. Super good. What else do we need? Planes. I gotta remember. Oh, I can't even make planes. I gotta get down here first. Oh, goodness. That's not good. You guys might as well stop attacking. That's uh, not a smart idea to do that. Um, hope you don't get encircled. Hope you don't. Cool. We're doing pretty okay around here, I'd say. Pretty okay. Now, these guys should start starving soon enough. I mean, I don't see any way they can throw more supply. Hey, there goes part of China. Cool. Hold them in place. Because these guys, even though they're connected by like the little lake here, really shouldn't do too much to help them out. Come on. Now we're losing there. We're losing here, too. That's not really ideal. Tank wise. Cool. Get up there. You know, help them out for now. Uh, Sri Lanka? No, not quite. Help them out. Put tons of pressure on them. Come to Buffalo. Are they attacking me anywhere else? No, not really. 
So be it. So be it. Oh, darn it. They, they knew what I'm doing. Come on. Kind of went in here. I like it. Good. Hey. Yeah, Egypt will gladly take some more stuff. Do we actually win there? Nice. Good. Now we got the tanks there. You guys move up. Move up, move up, move up. Get to Toronto again. We've lost 400,000. They've lost 309,000. You know, it is what it is. How about you don't let them move and cut that division completely off? And you guys have them out. See what happens. Good, good, good. Come up here. Encircle, destroy, encircle. Good. Attach them lightly. Hey, look at that. An encirclement has worked. Yes, yes. Yes. Cool, do that. Do that, my friends. Do that. Head on down here, if you can. Oh, this is getting real nice right now. Oh, they're attacking us over there. That's very good, very good. Keep it up. Keep it up. We have a few armored cars, which is, you know, they're okay. Not great. Keep it up. They have three divisions. I don't know why they're not starving yet. It doesn't make any sense. Camouflage, very nice. Uh, Mountaineers, Masteries of the Seas. Oh, we'll do this one. So, English Fleet Mobilization. So we can get rid of this. We get look, just slightly more population and... Slightly faster dockyard output. Beautiful. We got Toronto back, my friends. Awesome. 204 factories. Are we still building up more? We need to be building up more, 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 more. We need to research that one that gives us even more stuff. Imperial Raj, you're looking beautiful, man. Wow, we've really built up Australia. For the most part. For the most part. Anything down here? Not really. We could build stuff in Egypt, I suppose, but... Eh. You can do that, too, over there. Come on, guys. Everyone in. Together for victory. And, yeah, Turkic Central Arabia has fallen. Very good, very good, very good. Keep them, in, keep them there. Nice, good stuff. Oh, they're dying. They're dying. Just hold the line for now. I'm glad we got New York. That's a little surprising. Look at that manpower. That's just beautiful. We can use a little bit more, uh, more support. Sure, why not? Don't let him move, don't let him move. Better engineers, we got even better defense. I'm going to do some logistic companies because we could use even better logistic companies. Maybe we should get some more planes. Hey, look at that. Thanks. What we could do is roll down this way and do that. Hey, now we got to fight some more Mexicans. Mexico, why? We liked you, Mexico. You were the chosen one. Passive defense. There we go. Um, actually, you guys could... Yes, you might get encircled. You might, you might not. We'll see what happens. At least we got Buffalo. We can cut these guys off, maybe. Cut, kill off those divisions. Uh, improve artillery. Upgrade. Good. Hit them harder. Nice. Let's grab some of this so we can get some more max factories in a state. Because that would be very, very bueno. Good. You guys are doing great. Holding them off. Oh, and there we go. You've been cut off, which is, you know, it's, an, it's a thing. It's a thing to do. Get cut off from time to time. It happens to the best of us. This episode has been very wonky for me, to be honest with you. We lost Toronto, but that's okay because they're about to lose their lives. Hey, nice. Land of Explorers, Masters of the Sea, New Frontier, Lee Enfield, Iron Cavalry. Let's go with the Lee Enfield. So, the Lee Enfield rifle is the best in the world and will continue to be for several decades. Well, I don't know what the future holds, but hopefully it will be. Do that. Japan! Yes, Japan. I love you, Japan. Thank you, Japan. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey, they've been cut off. Good. You guys hold them in place, actually. Beat them up in Toronto. Push in. Push in. You might be able to just, just do that. You know what? Go this way. So they can't reach us. Good. Nice. Help them from the butt. Well, I guess not, not really helping them from the butt if you're attacking them in the butt. Beautiful. You guys can go that way and then do that. Nice. Oh, wow, we've been cut off. Oh, that is really not good. Holy crud. 
We might lose our entire army here. But I guess that's where we're going to leave today's episode because it's been very, very weird. Hope you enjoyed today's episode, though. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you all tomorrow as we'll hopefully finish up the war against the U.S. and Mexico. And then maybe plot a course for another country. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.